As the weekend began, Ronald Burns was prepping chicken. The Hottie Toddy barbecue team is from Marietta and is one of 40 teams competing in Itawamba County's first ever Stand By Your Grill cook-off. This weekend there's a star-studded field here with, with people here that does this basically for a living, so uh, guys like us going to have to really step it up to you know, to have a chance. There's a lot at stake. $7,500 in prize money in the competition, which is sanctioned by the Kansas City Barbecue Society. Some teams travel in style. It's a 30-foot gooseneck. We started from ground up. Uh, we got some uh, backwood smokers, and we got a stainless fridge, a stainless double sink, big, big, deep double sink, and then we got a little wood burner on top. And you got satellite TV. Yeah, well, you, it's getting time for football season now. Each team has a strategy. Low and slow. Hot and fast. Low and slow. More than 40 judges have the tough task of tasting chicken, ribs, brisket, and pork. As far as the, um, the appearance, I look for something that just looks like something I want to eat. I look in the box and if it looks good, it's like, wow, I want to eat that, and that's a, that's a good score to me. And the same way with eating it, when you, when you go to, to uh, the taste of it, it should taste like what you're eating. If it's chicken, it should taste like a good piece of smoked chicken. For Brian Roberts of Fulton's Pit Stop Barbecue, this marks his first professional competition. Without giving your recipe away, how are you going to make it stand out? Just put all our heart into it. Do what we know best. Don't change a thing. We're going to cook like we would for the restaurant. Then there are veterans who travel the professional cooking circuit full time. Texan Johnny Trigg has been competing for 22 years and was featured on TLC's Pitmaster Show. I love the sport and it's growing all uh, every year. The contests are getting, this is a new contest here at Fulton and uh, they're going to learn a lot this weekend and they'll improve and it'll be a good contest. The Stand By Your Grill competition does more than attract a wide variety of barbecue cooking teams. It also gives locals a chance to showcase the area in hopes of attracting future contests and tourist dollars. In Fulton, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.